This video is brought to you by the YouTube channel JKSSB Exam Special. Have you ever thought about the rivers that course through the veins of our Earth providing life and shaping landscapes? Well, today, we'll delve into the intricate world of some of the most important rivers in India. Question 1. Which river is often referred to as the Ganga in India? The answer is the Ganges. Known as the holy river of Hinduism, the Ganges plays a significant role in Indian culture and spirituality. Moving on to the second question, the Brahmaputra River is also known as what in Tibet? It's known as the Yarlung Tsangpo. This mighty river starts in southwestern Tibet and flows through the Himalayas into India. Now, can you tell which river forms the border between India and Nepal? That would be the Kosi River. This river, often referred to as the Sorrow of Bihar, is notorious for its devastating floods. Next, do you know the river known as the lifeline of Kashmir? It's the Jhelum River. This river is a source of irrigation and hydroelectric power in the region. Fifth question, which river flows through the states of Himachal Pradesh and Punjab? It's the Bias River. This river is a significant source of water for both irrigation and hydroelectric power in these states. Now, can you tell me which river forms when the Alaknanda and Bhagirathi rivers converge? That's the Ganges again. These two headstreams meet at Devprayag in Uttarakhand to form this iconic river. Our seventh question, which river is also known as the River of Gold? That's the Sutlej River. It's called so because of the profitable silt it carries, which is used in agriculture. Now, which two countries does the Tista River flow through? It flows through India and Bhutan, playing a vital role in the ecology and economy of both countries. Next, do you know which river is a tributary of the Ganges and is famous for the Mahakumbh Mela? That's the Gandak River. This event is one of the largest religious gatherings in the world. And finally, which river is considered the easternmost and shortest of the major Himalayan rivers? That is, the Lohit River. Despite being short, this river is known for its strong currents and potential for hydroelectric power. To sum up, rivers play an immense role in shaping the geography, economy, and culture of a region. From the holy Ganges to the mighty Brahmaputra, from the lifeline of Kashmir, the Jhelum to the river of gold, the Sutlej, each river has its unique story and significance. So the next time you look at a river, remember it's not just a body of water, but a life-giving force that shapes our world in ways more than one.